The AFS Connect Magnum has a new feature, which has incorporated all of the light and turn signal functions into one simple stalk on the left side of the steering column. The layout of the stalk is as follows. Ring 1, detents for the road light control position, are from the top of the ring when the icons line up with the mark on the lever. Auto lights are first, and the lights will come on based on sensing sunrise or sunset. All lights are off. Work lights are enabled. In the roading position, both low and high beams can be activated. Lever turn signal lights. Push the stalk up to activate the right turn signal. Pull the stalk down to activate the left turn signal. There are green arrows in the A-Post display showing the turn signal direction. The turn signals are self-canceling when the front wheels return to the straight position. The horn button is located in the end of the stalk. Setting the lights through the AFS Pro 1200. First, to configure the lights in the AFS Pro 1200, the light stalk must be in the auto position. The lights for the tractor are configured in the AFS Pro 1200 display. In order to get to the screen, use the encoder or in the center of the armrest is a panel of gray buttons. Press the first gray button on the left, which will take the operator to the Pro 1200 display. Once there, go to the right side of the display and find and press the light wizard, and the menu for configuring the lights on the tractor will be displayed. Once the light screen is displayed, the operator can select what light combination they want to configure into memory 1 or 2. Once the selection is made, press and hold the memory to save the selection. The instrument cluster lights, nighttime backlighting, or the egress lights on the tractor can be adjusted to meet the customer's preference. By pressing the toggle switch in the headliner, the operator can then toggle between memory 1 and memory 2. The layout toggle switches of the headliner panel are as follows starting with the panel moving left to right. Mirrors. The first switch for the mirrors will adjust the mirror angles. The second switch for the mirrors will telescope the mirrors in and out. Defrost. Defrost the windows. AFS control. Turns the AFS guidance on or deactivates AFS when roading. Master lockout for the three-point hitch and hydraulics. The top position of the toggle switch activates the three-point hitch and the hydraulics. The middle position of the toggle switch locks out the three-point only, useful when operating in a drawbar application. The bottom position of the toggle switch locks out the three-point hitch and hydraulic system. The ISB toggle switch allows the implement to send information from the implement controller to the tractor. Air conditioning controls include the fan speed, heat, and automatic temperature control. Lights. Turns off memory 1 or 2 and activates the road lights. Memory lights toggle switch. The toggle switch has two positions for memory 1 and for memory 2 and when either are hit a second time, memory 1 or 2 will turn on the road lights. Hazard lights for travel on the road. Beacon lights for travel on the road. Wiper stalk. The AFS Connect Magnum has a second new feature which has incorporated all of the wiper functions into one simple stalk on the right side of the steering column. The layout of the stock is as follows. The windshield wiper controls all three wiper blades on three rings on the handle. Ring number one is the furthest out on the lever, controls the front wiper, and has five positions or detents from front to back on the ring. Front wiper and wash. This position is momentary and will turn on the wiper and washer pump. Front wiper off 
in the detent when it lines up with the mark on the lever. Front and rear wipers are on intermittently. Go to the second ring in, and the further forward the ring is turned, the shorter the delay on the wiper activation. There are five delay positions on the second ring. Front wiper low speed. Front wiper high speed. Ring 3, the closest to the steering column, has four detents in it. Rear and optional side window wiper and wash is momentary and will operate as long as the operator activates the ring. Rear wiper off in the detent when it lines up with the mark on the inside of the lever. Rear and optional side wipers operate intermittently according to the settings on ring number two. The further the operator turns the ring forward, the shorter the delay in the function. By pushing down on the wiper stock momentarily, the wiper will wipe the front windshield. Pulling up on the wiper stock momentarily, the wiper will wipe the rear and side windows if equipped. Rear wiper low speed. Please follow and do the exercise to check or set the climate temperature in the cab. The climate temperature in the cab can be located through the encoder, climate shortcut, or the wizard on the right side of the screen. Note, in this demonstration, we push the climate shortcut on the armrest. Once the path is selected, the tractor HVAC screen will be displayed. The temperature can be changed by sliding the bar left or right. The fan speed can also be changed in the same manner. Other areas the operator can configure is the mode, auto or off. The air distribution, how and where the air is distributed within the cab. And the final area will be defrost, maximum defrost, defrost of the mirrors, and defrost of the rear and side windows, if equipped.